Hello! We're right back in it. <laughs> and it is not anything I want to be a part of. I'll tell you that much right now. Let's just drop down here. This just seems safe. It seems like a place provided to me by ones who care about my well-being. Oh. oh. Stop. <gasps> bench. Non-goopy bench. Oh, yep. We're in it. We are in that place. Oh! Did it just, like, take me up? I think it just took me up. I think if I go down this hole... Yeah, this will start making my way over to... Yeah, this is the sticky icky. Um... Mr. Mask Man, uh... I don't... I've got a complaint to file against you, and uh, the misdeeds caused to me by your work. But now, it is time to go confront the beast. Reminds me of uh, what we do in the shadows, which is a hilarious movie if you've never seen it. I think it's on Amazon Prime Video. You can watch it. I don't know how else to get a hold of it, but yeah. Would highly recommend. Oh, oh geez, hi. Oh, I wish I was a Dash Master. Okay. Again, I don't know why I tried doing anything other than the charge attack. Oh, I countered him. <laughs> you can kind of tell, like, he'll get into patterns for, like, walk away or approach. And then he has to, like, sit in the correct distance. For a little moment before he attacks you. So if you just stand still. When he's like. Far enough away that he's not able to hit you. He'll scoot forward. Wait just a second. Oh is the beast maybe not so bad. Is the beast maybe. A friend. A sleeping figure lay atop the stone plinth. Is the beast maybe gonna have a beast feast. That was an unusually wealthy. It's guarded by sacred light. A sleeping figure lies atop the stone plinth. Is this the beast lair? No, we're not over to it yet. All right, let's fall through this hole then. Do I maybe wake that person up by defeating the beast? I'm sorry. Have I already been through here? It was not but a circle. That was the sparkle splankliest section of the world, I think. And that's a worm friend. So what the heck? I don't like how frequently this game has you go to the edge of the earth just to present you with something that looks cool in a really vague dialogue box and then send you back to where you came from with like no idea what you've accomplished. You know? I feel like it was trying to do that to us in like the Soul Sanctum, but then it just like right at the end. I was super getting like, okay, cool, we came here for nothing vibes, and then right at the end it was like, surprise, boss fight! But, uh, Like, even the edge of the earth, like, the crystal caves, whoever, kind of did that. It seemed like it was leading up to something, but then it's just like, nope, uh, here's a power, bye. And I mean, like, what is this? Where am I? Oh, yeah, don't disturb the light. I need to knock out all the candles. Okay. Cool. Okay, cool. Never mind.
Okay, yeah. <laughs> 100% confusion and not understanding what's going on. So at this point, was was this whole area like for nothing then? I feel like I explored all around in here. Gosh dang it. Buttons, please. Like, where, am I, where else am I supposed to go? Down more, I guess? Like, ugh. Guess I can open up the stagway. What's down? Oh, actually something. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Potential mistake? Soundtrack is starting to do strange things, I'll be honest. Um! Um! <laughs> oh, what a time we're having. Oh, yes. Okay, I'm starting to think maybe the beast is a shapeshifter. And I'm starting to think that copy of us that we saw was the beast, and that maybe that dude that spooked me on my way out of getting the uh, like the Weaver song, whatever, was the beast, and maybe that freak was the beast, the freaking beast. Why don't you approach me and get into attack stance? Mother Beaster. Can I maybe kill the beast and get the ability to climb webs that I make with my butt? Uh. Oh, that's barricaded from the other side. Wait, I haven't been here. This looks like this is some place I've been. Maybe. Oh gosh. Jeez, man, with the crumbly floor crawling weirdness. Gosh. Okay, yeah, I have definitely been here. Um, oh gosh. So I accidentally messed up super hard by falling down. Oh gosh. And now we have to climb our way back through like the whole area. Oh gosh. That's just spooky design right there. Oh. If you're a cool dude, you'd remember that there's spikes below you, because you can see them from the other side. Like that. And then you would know about it. Okay, I just need to find my way to get back to this village, and then go open up the stagway. And then, if nothing else, we'll have done that. Okay, sweet, we did it.
No, please. Oh my gosh. My wall jumping off of tiny platform skills are super lacking. Okay, nice. Nice, made it. Oh, spiders, please. Oh good, and they broke they broke the bench. Achievement unlocked connection. I don't know if that's worth. Oh my gosh. Let's go back to town. City storerooms? What? I don't think I've opened this one. Oh, yeah, it's this one, okay. Sorry. Let's go back to Dirtmouth. <laughs> oh my gosh, all of this started because I wanted to explore Green Path. Okay, we'll see what sort of things we have to buy in the shop. Whew. And, uh... Hmm. I was in the Beast's Lair, and I didn't find anything while I was there. Which seems a little bit unfair. So I might give that another look. I just have so much money. I might as well. I also might as well. Nice. See so if we can't get our hands on another one of those. And other than that, I don't even know what else I would want to buy. I mean, there's stuff from the uh, badge vendor lady way downtown. But hey, I don't know her. What does the <sighs> map lady have for sale? Oh, sorry, just a bunch of markers? Nah. Who needs them? Who needs them? You know what? Actually, I think, though, this time for reals, let's just go do the Mantis Lords. Like, no delay. Let's just go there today. And I'll unlock, gosh dang, Queen Station as we're going. And everything is gonna be peachy. Everything's gonna turn out okay for this little bug man, Hollow Knight bug thing, Nightman thing. <laughs> wow, that thing just keeps on rolling. Quickly making our way downtown. Oh. Oh man, everything seems so relaxed by comparison, like, it's all pleasant to look at, there's not a bunch of malark scuttling all over my screen, just, things are going pretty well. Okay, I actually have to go way over this way. I'll be completely honest, I don't remember huh, the layout of a lot of the uh, southeast parts of Green Path, because I haven't actually explored it that much. That is handy. The range on, like, the tornado when you tap X really fast is super huge. I don't remember if it's influenced by Long Nail. I would be both surprised or unsurprised if it was or wasn't. I mean, you know, either way. I could really see it going either way. Because I could see them feeling like Long Nail is too overpowered if, like, the spin attack already lengthens the distance your nail hits. Um, if then you also, like made it even crazier, but then also I could see them saying, like, well, what's the point of having long nail if it doesn't actually extend all your attacks, you know? I kind of want to go take a looky-loo back at the old hunter and see if he's got anything to say to us because of all the knowledge we've gained from killing people. I've been wondering about that for a long time, but we've not been around him in an even longer time, so... It's, like, not been convenient to come back and take a look-see. But now we're just right here, so... Might as well, might as well. Oh, no, Manama, please. Oh, no, Manama, please. 
Hmm. He calls a squib. I think that reminds me of uh, Elder Scrolls Marwen, where the first dude you meet's name is Jib. And as a kid, I always thought that was super weird. So do you have to like fill out the entire journal, and then does he give you a thing? Or does he not give you a thing? And the journal is just for lore. That'd be a really intense completionist thing to like completely fill out the journal. I, I, I would kind of feel like they'd make a reward for that, you know? And not even like a, the journey is the reward kind of reward, like an actual reward. Like, the Hunter's Fang, ranged attack or something. I don't, I don't know. I'm not a game designer. With this long nail being as obscenely long as it is, I wonder if I can hit these guys. Or not the long nail, but the... You can, but it doesn't damage them. That definitely made contact before he, like, went inside his shell. Also, I don't recall... Oops. Oops. If the Stone Sanctuary has anything for us. Oh wait, but... I can't get there from here. Alright, well, let's ignore it. <laughs> Maybe I went and visited the Hunter, which like never amounts to anything, and then I didn't visit the Stone Sanctuary, and everyone's like, You idiot! Jellyfish training. Yeah. Oh, nice. There's the secret. Spike the jellyfish down and then hope they trigger a bunch of other people. Oh. I don't know that I've been over here. I don't remember this. Oh, dearie. That wasn't a platform. <laughs> I thought those little bushes were a platform and that I could go down there and it might be a secret. It's another way to go, but what's over here? Oh, a door. This looks acidic as all heck. That guy's new. It's a whole new area. You know, I have a map for this whole new area. Potentially. So far, I like it more than Jellyland. This area looks great. Oh, Well. Maybe someday I'll learn about the power to seal the darkness. Just like Legend of Zelda. Oh, wait. Is there more to do over here? Aha! A big old glowing hippie drug house. Out delightful. These shrub bugs aren't hurting anybody. Did it for the diary. Should we should look up what they're about, anyways? Moss fly, winged weakling that covers itself in the leaves to appear larger, hides amongst the undergrowth, fleeing if predators draw near. Huh. I wonder if this is dirty acidic runoff from the lake of. Mm. Overgrown mound. Hey girl, let me take a peek at your overgrown mound. I apologize, I'm so sorry. That was the actual worst. This kind of reminds me of the witch's den. Where we got soul burst in the first place. Nope, nope, nope. Don't eat my inputs when I press jump, please. Ah! <laughs> Get away from me, mosquitoes. Oh. Mosquito mini fight. Not impressed. Not impressed. I'm starting to get the feeling that maybe I was supposed to come here a long time ago. 
Did I hit him at the perfect time and he dashed like straight down? <laughs> Your reward is more mosquitoes! Enjoy! It's a big old geo mound. That was an overgrown mound of mine. Even more mosquitoes. Oops. Hello. Jar headed slug lady. Consumed the Howling Wraiths. Tap B while holding up to unleash the Wraiths. Spell will deplete soul or replenish soul by striking Yamama. It is. It's a dead witch friend. Oh. My. So we have a sweet downward soul attack and now we have an upward soul attack. <laughs> Something about that beautiful rainbow of death, and then him just going <laughs> and hit the ground. All right, well, immediately better rewards than the beast's den, so that's cool. Um, yeah, in the next video, let's go fight some dang mantis lords. I said I wasn't getting distracted, and look where we are. Frickin' don't even know. All right, well, see you then, everybody.